Hi, my name is Michael Trout and I want to do a talk right now on how to really do a cool thing with Gmail, right? I'm the CEO, founder of something called FoundUps Corp. We are an open corp. And basically, think of us as an open Google. Think of every product in Google, ultimately, same kind of products are going to be parts and ideas of FoundUps Corp. And we use a collaborative framework called the Open Incubator Framework to launch ideas into early stage startups doesn't cost anything. It's free for anyone to join. And we actually have our Alpha 100 um, um, initiative launching basically from startup, uh, um, sorry, Global Entrepreneur Week November to next November is going to be a race. How many of our 100 found-ups are going to launch as a private placement next December? And you can follow them on foundupstv.com. Um, which isn't set up yet, but if you go to Wikitube TV, wikitube.tv, you can get an idea. So let me, I don't have a lot of time here, let me quickly go through something that I want to share with you, which is, which is a great way to use Gmail. So if you've got Gmail address and you are using Gmail as your web address, you're doing something wrong. So if you go to your email options, okay, and um, you'll basically see something here called send mail as. So what this has allowed you to do, and you and basically as long as you have access to email, send mail from another address, okay, learn more, you can click on that, um, you can actually set up multiple emails. Now why do you want to do this? One is, you know, maybe you want to send an email from you as your work address, right? Maybe you want to, you know, you want, you know, you don't want your boss and stuff reading all your email. It's your email, right? And right now, if you work for an employer, they have access to every email you send and come send in. Now, a way around that is to basically add your email to, to Gmail, and now you've basically taken control away from them. You still send mail out, you can set up, like if you notice here, I've got different, I can have different uh, signatures. Um, if I'm sending out press, actually I haven't set that one up yet, but I think if I do news, here's uh, legal. Let's see what legal says. Oh, I don't have that. I haven't set them all up yet. Um, come on, where's, uh, I thought I did press news. Okay, so news about FoundUps Corp, right? As an open Google, blah, 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 blah. So, um, you know, you can, you have a lot of flexibility. So how do you set this up? And I want to basically teach you through GoDaddy, right? So if you go to GoDaddy, and this is a demo FoundUps account that I set up. It took me about 30 minutes to set up just so I can make this. So you hack away. I don't give a crap. There's nothing here for you to, to steal. So you're going to go to basically free products, and you're going to set up on free products. You're going to set up something. I'm just going to talk you through it, okay, under free products. You're going to go to something called email account list. Under email account list, you're going to set up email forwarding plans, all right? And under email forwarding plans, you're going to hit manage account. So you can go back and watch. So here I am. Well, I already had it set up. So add an email address to it. And I'm going to add an email to an account that's expiring that I'm not going to be renewing. So I click on add. It'll say it's Mike. Here's the domain, right? Here's a domain that's expiring. And I'm going to have it go to me at mtrout, okay, dot com. So basically, it's going to redirect. Now, this actually redirects to my Gmail. And see, here's a little added security. I'm not giving you my Gmail. I don't want you to know what my Gmail address is, even though you probably saw it when you were on my main screen. Um, but anyway, uh, it doesn't matter. So, And I can make, make this a catch-all. So a catch-all means anything to TEDx Future Ed is going to come to me. All right? So I click on OK. All right? So here it is. Now, um, I have it set up. So now... Um, if I go to uh, my, why is it not showing here? <laughs> it's not showing. No email. Okay, email forwarding. It should have worked. Oh, it's actually, it's making me purchase. So it's funny. I had an account, so I don't know what's going on here. I had an account to set up 100, and basically it didn't accept it. So this is cheap. Two ninety five a year to add five or more email accounts, that's a great deal. Every time you purchase an account, you're going to get a coupon to get a, a 100 um, forwarding accounts from GoDaddy. Probably after seeing this video, they're going to gimp this down, all right, um, and not give you 100. But, you know, so get in quick, get yourself a GoDaddy and set up the thing. So I hope you've enjoyed this talk. My name is Michael Trout. Um, I'm gonna, this is part of OIF. So if you have the OIF manual, uh, you'll get a lot of this. So check out the link below, get the OIF manual, make a donation, and I wish you the best in your found up startups.